Okay. Hold up. We're gonna go fishing with a really special lure today, but first I have to find it. package I got this uh, from a little box that my cousin gave me the other day full of old fishing gear you ready boom mermaid saucy mermaid make a quick modification then we'll hit the water with it right back just a couple more finishing touches and voila this is a family channel I'm gonna tie this saucy mama on and we're gonna hit the water. Let's tie this silly Sally on and see if we can't catch fish. Where the heck is my Sitica? There it is. Disaster averted. My Sitica's all clean. I just opened her up, tore her apart, filled her up with nice, nice new lube. She's ready to go, throw a mermaid around, see what the bass think. And voila, Saucy Sally is all rigged up. I'm gonna throw you all on my chest. Alrighty, we're all rigged up, ready to go. I have no idea what it's gonna do, but uh, I'm gonna throw it. Is it top water? Or is it gonna dive? We'll find out. Oh boy. It's a topwater mermaid. Nope, nope, it's sunk. I don't know what it's doing now. Do I jerk it? Do I just reel it? Oh, if I reel it, it just kind of comes up and skims the surface. But if I let it sit, it drops. Oh, wow. It's like a slash bait. It actually doesn't look too bad. <laughs> oh my gosh. It really doesn't look terrible. Wind really picked up. I have no idea what I'm supposed to do with this stupid thing, but I'm determined to catch a fish on it. Windy. Every single one of my videos is windy. If I come down here when I'm not filming, it's dead still. The fish should be starting to like move up. They should be starting to get on beds and stuff. Maybe I can get one real angry. I think that this mermaid's coming in to steal her man. That's what I want. A big old spawning female to come up and be like, uh oh. You can't take my man. Oh, baby. First catch on the mermaid. We're doing great. At least her uh, bikini top staying on. I was worried about that. Whew. This pond is so tiny, but for whatever reason, that side is always windier than this side. It's like it just picks up across the pond and just moves. I think I got some scum. I think I've been scummed up. Kind of has a cool fall to it. Once I twitch it, it kind of falls real, real nice. Like does a little shimmy. I'm all about the shimmy. What happens if I just like straight reel it in? See if you guys can see the action on this thing. Yeah, if I just reel it, it's just gonna sit on top. It really does move nice though when you twitch it. It's got big old like saltwater hooks on it. I'm pretty sure it's for stripers or like bluefish or something. Maybe I'll catch a merman. It sinks so fast, I have to work it pretty quick. Kind of wish it didn't work so fast or sink so fast. I think I got a, a grassy ass. <laughs> Crack myself up.
She's so beautiful. How come no one's eating it? I'd e oh no. I caught a snail. <laughs> That's not good, poor guy. I'm standing back from the edge here, trying not to spook anything. It's just flopping around hopelessly on the surface. I don't know what I'm expecting here. Just an eight pounder to come out of nowhere and hit it. There's a swirl out there. There's got to be one or two fish that are just aggressive, you know? It's warm enough. The sun's beating in. It's been warm yesterday. I got to catch one dumb one. She's wiggling her little butt and wiggling her little tail in there. It's not enough to entice him though, huh? She's got such a nice flash underwater with all that silver. Oops. Mm. Why? What did I ever do to wrong you? I gave you a sense of dignity. And this is how you return the favor. Oh, geese, right. Going around, it's okay, it's okay folks. I mean, you're right where I wanna be. It's cool though, we're friends. We can hang out sometime. Once this whole, you know, situation's over, we can go hit the bar, whatever, whatever you want. I see you, do it. Do it, you won't. Do that one. Maybe I should dip her in some, some spike it. Give her a chartreuse tail, some garlic scent. All right, I'm doing it. I'm getting spike it. We need every chance we can get to catch a fish. That's some of that good, good. Ah, come back. I hate this stuff. It smells so bad. But I love this stuff. Let's give her the old full dip. Oh no, the hooks don't fit. Crap. Crap. Oh, her tail doesn't fit. I just want to splash a little bit on her. Okay, this is going to get dangerous. I got to go to the grass. Uh-oh. Her bikini is dissolving. Oh, no. All right, that's it. That's all she's getting. Well, maybe a little more on the tail. Oh, gosh. It just sprayed everywhere. That is some saucy stuff. Let's see, I think I got a rag somewhere. I should probably not put that in my car yet. Until I wipe it off, you stay, you stay put. 20 full extra load fishing wipes. The grind boss is in. They smell just as bad as the garlic. Wow, this is just a terrible, terrible sensation. I smell. <coughs> The spike it combined with the smell of this. <coughs> oh wow, that's bad. I'm okay. Whew. We. Oh mermaid, why do you hate me? I just want to catch a fish. Do -do -do -do. Oh I'm. Little fish, that's all I want. 
Juan le tofi Yeah, I think I'm gonna move. I gotta, I gotta catch a fish. I gotta catch a fish on Sassy Sally or Sassy Sandra or whatever the heck I've been calling her. Saucy, Saucy Sandra, Saucy Sally. I think that's what it was. I don't know. Last chance fish. Bite it or lose it forever. She's gone. All right, Sassy Sandra, Sally, Susan, I don't know, what the heck. You got one more chance to prove yourself. All right, it's just me, the GoPro, the beautiful little mermaid, and that pristine little farm pond down there, loaded with bass. If this doesn't work, if I can't get a fish here on this, it's not looking good for the old mermaid. Cows are penned up. Usually I gotta fight them pretty bad. Not today. They're rambunctious, they're little heifers going through their teenage rebellions. All right, little mermaid, now is your time to shine. I was catching them on Chatterbait here last week or two weeks ago, something like that. So, you know, it's basically the same thing, right? Chatterbait, mermaid. There's a fish. Nope, nope, it's not. I got a little overexcited. I caught a bank. <laughs> oh man, I thought something smoked it as soon as it hit the water. Nope, 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 not the case. Aw, oh, turtles, turtles. I love turtles. Turtles make me happy. I like turtles. Come on, Sheila. Work with me. Work with me, Sheila. All right, y'all, before I end this video, or before you guys click away, because I'm not catching any fish on this lousy mermaid, I need your help with something. I want to challenge Marling Bates to make a mermaid that just completely outclasses this silly little mermaid bait that uh, is not doing any good here today. Uh, if you don't know who Marlon Bates is, he has an awesome channel. He makes lures and then goes and fishes with them. He does cool one day builds where he builds a lure and tries to catch fish all in the same day. Really cool guy. But uh, I don't know, I've never met him, never talked to him or anything like that, not affiliated with him at all. But I think it would be really cool for him to try to make a mermaid and uh, catch some fish on it. So uh, if you could bombard him in the comments, go over to his videos, check out his channel, I'll link it. Check out his channel, bombard him in his comments about trying to make a mermaid swim bait uh, that outrivals fishing haulers, lousy little uh, trinket here. <laughs> uh, you can go over to Instagram. Uh, my Instagram is fishing underscore holler. Follow me there and also bombard him there. PM him, do whatever. Just get it out there, get him to hear that, uh, that he needs to make a mermaid bait that uh, actually catches fish and it actually works. I'd love to see a mermaid one day. So Marlene Bates, the ball is in your court, or I guess the bait is in your pond. Yeah, yeah, that sounds good. The lure is in your pond. <laughs> Show us how it's done, man. Oh, was that hit? Was that hit? No, it was grass. Oh, guys, I did it. I caught a fish on the mermaid. <laughs> oh, I snagged a poor little bluegill. Oh my goodness. That is the saddest thing ever. <laughs> but I'm kind of happy at the same time. Oh, I gotta get a picture of this, poor guy. Oh man, well. As Marling Bates would say, it's official. Sonnies, <laughs> get in the way of mermaids.
<laughs> Mermaids hate sunfish. <laughs> oh man. There you go, Marling Bates. Try to one-up me on that. Guys. I caught a stick. Oh. <laughs> I've been fooled again. <gasps> oh, why, mermaid? Why? She's trying to crawl under a rock. <laughs> oh, what was that? I must have got a snapper. It is good at dredging the pond out. I'll give it that. <laughs> I'll come every time. Oh, I caught a big old log. This could be the end. This could be the end of her. Nope, she pops free every time. Oh, no, she's gone, she's gone. Line snapped, clean off. No, no, Sharon, or no, what did I, Sheila, Sheila. Oh, no. Well, with that, terrible bombshell roll the outro that I filmed a few minutes ago wah, wah, wah. well folks with that I think that about does it the mermaid has failed us we worked her long and hard but in the end she just couldn't finish if you want to see more mermaid action drop a thumbs up and I might take it back out down to the river maybe catch a smallmouth or a uh, elusive muskie you never know if you want to see more content, please subscribe to the channel and uh, please drop me your thoughts down in the comments. I'd love to hear what you thought about the video and uh, maybe tell me about some uh, funky lures that you found around out and about. So thank you all for watching. Take care of yourselves, stay well, and uh, always remember, it's all about the shimmy. <laughs>